I'm Alice. And I'm Jess. And we are now in country number 10. Japan! Japan. Come and join us as we travel around this beautiful country. Immersing ourselves in the culture and trying all of the amazing food. And doing some incredible things. Like this. Like this. And this. Like this. We do a lot of this. <laughs> Subscribe and follow our journey as we are on the move. So what are we doing today then, Alice? Monkey car. It's an amazing experience. You can ride go-karts around Tokyo. And we are super stoked to be doing this today. I don't think many people have heard about it um, or if it's common knowledge, but it is, it is like one of the most fun experiences to do here in Tokyo. So me and Jess thought we'd take this opportunity to do it whilst we're here. And we cannot wait. Luckily for me, I've got my international driving license, so I can actually ride a go-kart. Jess, unfortunately, doesn't have an international driving license. But the good thing about monkey kart is, is that they could have guides and Jess can sit on the back of a guide's vehicle, which means she can enjoy it as well. She's just not riding the go-kart. So we're going to go in now, get checked in and go get dressed up. Oh my gosh, how cool is this? You come in, you have got all these outfits. Pikachu, Minions. Jess has gone as a penguin. I've gone as the cookie monster. I love cookies. Look at all the bikes. Look how I'm all lined up. how to use the go-karts. I'm at the front. I'm absolutely buzzing. Bring it on. Cookie Monster is about to go around Tokyo.
We've just finished monkey cart. Absolutely insane. I got more of adrenaline rush oh today God. than I did at Disneyland. <laughs> you have to do it. They got the best team of people and honest to God, yeah. we had the best time. And, every, and you're going around. I didn't realize you actually go over like the Shibuya yeah, crossing. Yeah, full on tour. Harajuku, you go in, everyone is literally staring at you. You're just like... But yeah, the reactions just made it even better as yeah. well because you've got kids going <gasps> and smiling and waving and I'm like, I'm trying to like wave back to everyone and everyone's reactions and they're taking photos of you. So it just makes you feel like you're a part of like <laughs> this Mario Kart game. I cannot believe we've just done that. That is the coolest thing I've ever done coolest thing i've yeah, ever done the adrenaline uh, rush the experience the staff were amazing yeah and what what i was on i don't know what it was some kind of bike yeah it's Super really cool fast yeah like i would put my foot flat to the floor and i could not catch up <laughs> i was just like and jess was gone and some corners you took you nearly came off <laughs> but the go-kart is so sensitive i didn't tell you this but like you one little thing and i go like that really? yeah yeah and you've you feel like it's gonna be like you're gonna spin or turn over or yeah. something like that but obviously it's a go-kart isn't it yeah so well can, my driver go said super the quick. go karts are more fun to ride oh, so fun so much fun yeah it's, it was such a good way to see it all it's such yeah. a good like to say that we've done that now here out of all places yeah like we've been over the shibuya crossing on a go-kart <laughs> dressed up in characters that's the coolest thing you can do in Japan. And also, um, just to mention about prices, Jess was 8,000 yen to ride as a companion. And then mine was 1,400 yen to actually have a go-kart. You've got to keep your passport and international driving license on you whilst you're driving. Yeah. But brilliant, brilliant guide. They explain everything so clearly, like, Yeah, incredible. and obviously it was a massive perk that I got to go on the back as well because I could film, but um they got some amazing shots they yeah. would stop at the red light and run around getting photos and videos of everyone and it was a real yeah we came trip. we came back to a photo already printed and we've got our whatsapp photos that they just flooded yeah. through they, they've taken like 100 photos of us absolutely amazing come and do it if you're in tokyo we obviously got the rest of the day to play with and it's quite late now um so we're gonna probably just head somewhere nice and watch sunset hopefully so we're gonna go do that now
How much do you love the city? Uh, I don't want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> it's very cool. So this is the Shinjuku area. train and we were admiring Shinjuku and all the lights and the hustle bustle in the evening which makes it even more fun and vibrant and then this lovely man came over and approached us and said that he's studying photography, photography and um, on his project he's got this Polaroid camera and um, he's taking photos of people and then like we pay a donation for it so we thought we'd do it and it's still developing now but how cute is this? like a really cool memory right yeah, he was really sweet and yeah we had a lovely chat and yeah good luck with your travels if you're watching this but yeah how sweet yeah, so lovely and he lived in london for half a year yeah how funny what a coincidence I know. so so nice Ooh. wow Is it this way? Lane's so close. Heading to the observatory. In the government building. Apparently it's a free viewpoint. <laughs> super cool and even better because it's free and it's still got like nearly 360 views and it looks stunning yeah over there how insane yeah we want to come back in a day now don't we uh, how cool is that how amazing <laughs> that was definitely worth it and now we're gonna hop back on the train and go and find some food yep so we were just up there so cool what a day mind. So we just found like this chain kind of restaurant I think. I'm not sure what the name is. We'll have a look at it when we go back outside. But yeah, you kind of like get set meals and stuff and it's reasonably priced. We've got all of this for 880 yen, which I know is quite expensive, but you get all of this. So we're gonna eat this now and fill up our bellies. So for free they serve brown rice tea here, so I'm going to give it a try. Wow. Yeah? That's better than I expected. It's nice and hot too, so it's warm me up. 